guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be planning in my classic happy planner from April 8th to April 14th. And I'm going to be using uh, the 1050 book. Um, and this is extra challenging for me because not only am I going to do the stickering challenge, but I'm challenging myself to use this sticker book that I've had for ever and it doesn't have very many stickers per page so that's going to limit I've used it and used it so that's going to limit um, my choices so I'm really um, kind of pushing myself to my limits by doing this but that shows you that even if you you can use up a sticker book um, uh, you know that that you think you've used all your favorite things out of it, but this may just show us that we can um, use them up until they're gone. So, fingers crossed, guys. I'm really hoping this goes well. Goes well. So, um, I'm gonna talk through this one. Normally, I um, put music over because with the dogs, blah blah blah. So you still may hear the dogs, but hopefully not. But I want to talk with talk you through this because I figure that way then you can see why I'm making the choices I am, et cetera, et cetera. So let's get started, guys. Okay. So basically with the stickering challenge, what's up what that means, um, uh, Tamara, the paper and pen girl, has started had started that. And it's a uh, hashtag stickering challenge, I believe. And what her challenge was is to use one sticker book and take a sticker from each page, each if there are 30 page sticker book, which they all are pretty much except for a few, um, take a sticker from each page and use it in your spread. So we're gonna give it a go guys, so <laughs> let's go. Okay, so let's see, where do I want to start? Let's start off, with, which is nice because I have this color in here, but what I really like is I have this floral border down here, so that's going to help me pull in, like there's purples up there, pinks there, there's blues, greens, turquoise, or teal, so I think we might be okay. So anyway, I think I'm going to start off I don't usually cover up my calendar but I think today I'm going to try it because this looks like it may fit perfectly over it so let's give it a try here um, this says have courage and be kind so I'm going to try to center this over that as best I can you know that worked out perfect so that's our first page all right, so the next page. I'm going to try to keep everything in frame here, guys. I kind of get excited and things move around and uh, such. So on this page, we have the same thing. We have colors that match, so we're okay. We could pretty much choose anything. Um, but, you know, this, these pages so far have been okay uh, for use. But as we get further back with all the pinks and stuff, it gets a little bit out of control. Uh, so I like this. Let's put this weekend banner here. Uh, so we'll take that and put the weekend banner over here. That doesn't look cut quite very well. Like it, they cut off the bottom of it, but that's okay. Okay, so our next page has all of these colors on, like a peachy and salmon. So I kind of have that down here in my floor in my florals. So let's do let's use one of these full boxes. I guess we better start somewhere here with full boxes. So let's use this one. And I'm gonna put that on Monday. I need to move my little bag here that I keep all of my uh, items in that I plan with. So normally I put these toward the bottom and I put headers on them because these are the older books and they were made for the ones that had the thicker bars. So we'll see what goes. Um, but for right now we're just going to go with that. 
Okay, so we have this one. I really like this box because it pulls in a lot of different colors. So I think I'm going to, that's my first gut. It, gut instinct is go right there or go, I guess I could go there too. Um, but I, let me look here and just make sure. Of course this hello banner would be pretty above this. On love today. Let's do love today actually. Let's go with this. I just don't know, guys. I don't know what we're going to end up with, but hang with me here. We'll see how it turns out. So, I don't know if you can use more than one sticker per page or not, but I'm just going with the one sticker per page, so everything goes well. So, I um, think I'm going to pull another full box, and I'm going to pull this full box off of here because we have something that pretty much matches with our colors that we already have on our page so that was the safe the red would have been pushing it because i really didn't have anything that um matched with that so and then i think i'm gonna take another full box in that color and i'm gonna put it see usually skip one and then let's put it down here hopefully I'm in in the shot there we'll put that one down there get our book back over here okay so here is one of those pages I was talking about where I've used a lot off of it but that's okay we can still find something um, for sure maybe I will a header off of this and use the one that says focus turn this so I can get this on here that's not going to work I'll put it this way yeah that looks good alright so our next page we've got more of these colors which is good and I think let's see what we got here guys weekend adventure this is the chance we take with the pops <laughs> there we go I'm gonna shut the door on that. I apologize for that guys um living in a house with two doggies you know so anyway I was saying on this be always joyful. Boy, I like that one, that circle. Got this. We have uh, some checklists. Let's do one of these checklists on Wednesday. Actually, hmm. I may take, I'm, I think I'm going to change my mind on that. I'll put this one back. And I'm going to pull this white one. Because it's, I don't want to get too much of this color, and then as we get further back in the book, it's going to be hard to coordinate things. All right, so that was that page. We'll hang on to that other checklist for now. Okay, good. We're getting some with multiple colors in there. Hmm. I'm going to put this full box up here. Of that page. Ooh, look at the flowers. This book is so beautiful. I know why I used the heck out of it. <laughs> I was probably saving that. I've been saving that for I, I I don't know what, but I'm saving it. So I'll tell you what. Let's not save it anymore. Let's use it today. Let's use this as our other box down here. Sorry, I keep having to move my planner, guys. But if I don't. Everything will be really, really crooked. It's probably only sort of crooked right now. So, so okay, those boxes will go all right. I mean, like I said, we're lucky because we have this border down here. It's kind of helping to pull everything in. So we put our floor box off of that page. Okay, now we're getting into 
with the blacks but we do we have the gold which we can use for the foiling because we have some of that here I'm trying to think see the days I don't I work I don't get myself checklists because I try to just get you know if I can come home and get something done uh, household wise I'm happy so let's put what do you think guys let's put do we have any headers here let's put this write it down on the top of this box so we can fill that in and then I'll put like a colorful box there later on so we can um write in what we want to accomplish that day okay so the next page we got another page with your blacks and your golds hmm I think I'm gonna go for another header guys just write it down I'm gonna put it over on this one because I'd like to get these filled in I I don't like that empty space I never did so okay now this is going to be a little more challenging <laughs> so let's see one nice thing they usually have the plain little um white boxes but they do have the colors of like the red the red white and blue in there so we're gonna see how we can make this work so on this one hmm i don't know guys this is a rough one here. Let's just take, let's keep it simple. And I'm just going to make keep it easy, I guess, for myself. And I'm going to take one of these little, which this book isn't printed and cut very well, unfortunately. These were back in the days that things were just, they were working out the kinks. But I'm just going to take this little heart and I'm just going to put it as a um, bullet point on Monday. Because usually I'll put a bullet point on each day at least, so... Um, that I'm that I am working so here is another red white and blue page so let's take another heart and we're going to use that on Tuesday actually no I'm going to spread that over here to Thursday just in case we have other bullet points we want to use we can kind of spread them out Okay, we're getting back into a little bit more of the colors. So we still need one more heading there. One more, um, oh, I forget what those are called, but uh, headers. Um, hmm. I don't know if I want to use one of those. I think, I wonder, I think I'm just going to take this happy day here. And just use it as a header and just kind of set it a little lower box so I can still get the, the color from the um, line above it on that page. So, okay. Let's see, what else do we got here? We got some cute little um, bullet points here. We've got. Um, some nice little headers we don't need any more headers though I think we're good um, how about this make today count that'll carry us some more pink in there and really it looks to me like this coral I've got to get some more of this coral in and I don't know well there's some right there maybe we'll just take that we'll put this back in the book and pull this coffee first in because it will carry some of that color over on this page just in case we don't come across any more of it i'm just thinking i'm gonna put it here coffee first okay so now we at least have a little bit of that on each page okay so hmm I want to go to this, but we already have so much of that color, so I kind of need to be using some of the other colors. I think I'm going to use this Dream Big because it has the pink and almost like the same colors as over here. And let's see where I want to put it, though. Let me get everything back in frame here. See how I just scooch everything and turn everything? It's awful. Um, 
I don't know what I'm going to do with that just yet. Let's see. Dream big. Why don't we put that on Wednesday? Okay, we're almost, well, well, not almost there, but, <laughs> um, hmm. there's a first coffee note to self, so busy, um, today, we're going to pull one of these bullet point hearts and put it on Tuesday. Should I put it? Nope. I'm going to put it right here in the middle. And the next page. Ooh, that one makes it a little rough. Red and white and gold. So. So we are going to grab another bullet point off this page. <laughs> I'm kind of cheating, I know, guys, but I just don't want this to be a too much of a hot mess, right? Let's put him here under the coffee first. That'll be our little check mark for that day. And then, hmm, I am going to take um, the goals and whoop, I'm going to put that. Oh, if I can get us onto my sticker stick here. And I'm going to put it on top of this where it says notes. So I can write my goals down for the week. Okay. Give yourself a pep talk. That's about what you need coming on Wednesday. Um, what do I want to do here? I know we're going to need some stuff. I'm going to scooch this over so good kind of see. Um, I know we're going to need something for the weekend. I've not seen any double boxes yet. So maybe since this is kind of close to that color, I'm going to give myself one of these boxes on the weekend with hopes that I can find a header that will work with it. Okay. So I guess this book isn't quite as bad as I thought. It has quite a few stickers missing, but it's not like it's a bear. But it has enough missing that it makes it a little bit of a challenge for me. Okay, so we'll do schedule over here. Because I really don't like to do anything major on Sundays. I like to keep it. Ooh, is that crooked? I like to keep it fairly open. So, that pulled up. I'm repositioned here. I'll tell you, this little tool is very, very helpful in trying to get things lined up. Well, I guess it wasn't in that instance. There we go. Okay. Sorry if my head got in the camera there. Okay, so let's see. Next page, we have... Hmm, what do we want to use here? Oh, I like this little box here because it doesn't have a lot of the colors on. It's just a plain box. So I think what I'm going to do is put that on Thursday because I will have some other things to do on Thursday. I'm going to just put that in the middle. So I have that there. And then hmm, I'm going to put this remember bar right above that. I hope we're doing okay for colors, guys. I kind of feel like we might be going off the rails here. Ooh, no. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Okay. Um,. This might be a bit of a challenge. We'll do it. We can do it here, guys. Um, hmm. You know what the easy way out would be? It would be this little checklist right here. And I think I'm going to take it. And I'm going to put it on, the other, on my checklist over here. 
under my goals. And there we go. That was easy, right? That was the easy way out of that one. Of course, we probably have more. Oh, yes, we do. Okay, guys, let me try. <laughs> have a thankful heart. That's cute. I like the green, but it's a little bright for what we have in our leaves down here. And then I'm afraid it'll clash with <clears throat> um, the color we have here. So, excuse me, guys. So sorry about that. Let's pull this one with the, the black dots. It kind of goes, it's the same as that one. So it will work on this side as well. Ooh, I'm going off the rails. There we go. And let's see. I need, I want to put another header there. I'm not sure what yet. I think I'm going to do, it's a plan over here, if I can get it to cover this up, because I like to put my meals over here, so that'll be my meal planning. Some pretty pages here, aren't they? Um, hmm. Let's use the day. Boy, is that purple pretty. I forget how pretty this book is because I don't get into it anymore that much, and that's a shame. Excuse me. Um, hmm. So I have to pull one on off of here. So busy day ahead. And I think Friday I have to do quite a bit of stuff at work. So I will put this one here. I have some errands to run and such. So that will remind me of that. And then we have some more of the pink. And you can see that's like the one I hit the hardest. Because that is pink. I, I just love it. So um, I like these little boxes. I think I'm going to pull some of this pink in from over here, up here. I mean, this is a little brighter, but I still think we're kind of doing, achieving the same thing. So, got some pink up there. I hope so, because, <laughs> oh, do the best I can with this, guys. So, next page. This is our last page, guys. So, here is the end of our, our uh, plan planning. Um, hmm. So, let's take one of these pink bullet points and put it up here under where it says busy day ahead so I can write a note of what I need to do for work. So guys, that is it. I took one from every page. So let's take a look at this um, now that it's finished. Um, I can't say that this is my absolute favorite spread I've ever done, but you know, it worked out okay. I mean, it, it turned out okay considering. So, uh, you know, it'll be fine. I'll use it this week and enjoy all of the different colors. I think it worked out well just by making sure that you put a little of this color and a little of that color, you know, this, the same color on both pages and here's the pink, you know and here and here and there's the green or the turquoise or whatever you want to call it too um i think that and then using the white background items to kind of soften and blend into to the spread kind of tames down all of the different colors but but i hope you enjoyed that as much as i did guys i thank you so much for stopping by and if you stuck around this long that means you like what i'm doing here so if you do i would appreciate if you could hit the subscribe button give me a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that notification guys because you want to know when i'm uploading or going live thanks so much for stopping by my channel guys take care bye